Welcome back to the channel guys, Ian from KI Fishing. So I got Cyrus and me today. Uh, we're out at this pond. Kruger and Twan have been here before. Uh, early, early spring. They didn't have any good luck, but we're gonna get it at it. We're gonna get at it today with the kayaks. There's a gate that they don't open until 9 a.m. But obviously there's a whole bunch of people here already. So it is what it is. So that's why I bought those little cart things so Cyrus can just pull his kayak on a cart and don't have to drag it but I only bought one like an idiot so I'm gonna drag mine all the way down to the pond As you can see it's way down there so see out on the water Cyrus is hooked up on something big already hang on I'm coming Nikes. Hang on. Hang on. Alright, I got him. Holy yeah! hell! Holy yeah! hell! Yes! Yo! Yo! Look at that toad! Look at that toad! You've got a bigger fish than I have. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at that toad! Oh my god! <laughs> I can't believe it. Yeah. The guy was loose, so that's why I was like, that's why oh. you can hear the on the thing. Look at that toad, guys! I am so proud of you! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my gosh. Uh, Alright, hang on, let's get the yeah. get the scale. The yep. Alright, bud. Good job. The big mamma jamma back down in there. Look at that. Oh yeah. Right there. Right there. Get you some of that. Get you some of that. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that was epic. That was epic. Good job, bud. Getting out here and slaying them like father like son. Time to get me one. Yeah. On that. From Malin's grandfather's old bass tackle box. That had to be at least 20, 30 years old. On that pink swim bait Texas rig. And he smoked it. He was just ripping some drag, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. Oh my gosh. That was intense. Uh -huh. I thought it was like a carp the way that drag was pulling. Uh, I can't believe Ash. Yeah, we weighed it and it was 314. We'll go 314. That was freaking epic. Fix your swim bait. I knew we had to go hit that weed line of the island and what it would produce. I knew it. All right. Good job, bud. Right? Oh yeah, it's a big old, I don't know if you guys can see it. There's a big old carp right next to me, right in the bottom. The, I'm in like two feet of water. The fish finder isn't gonna really do anything, bud. At this point, it's more sight fishing.
Look at that thing, guys. It's right beneath me. You can see it getting pushed. All the seaweed and stuff getting pushed. Graph out for the first time this year. The only thing is my arm isn't in yet. I did have it, my transducer mounted to the bottom of the boat, but I didn't, I couldn't close my clamshell and I got water in there and it was just annoying. So I ordered this Scotty arm or something like that. And I got this ram mount because I did have it bolted in the middle of my kayak, but it was a pain when I hooked into a bass. Let's try something real quick. Hmm? Is it right here? God. Look at that thing, guys. They're just getting it on. It's insane. All right, guys. We finally made it back up to the to the car with the kayaks. Loaded everything all up. We're good to go. Uh, this kid killed it today. Got that big old donkey. Uh -huh. <laughs> He finally beat me for the day. I got skunked here. I'm probably gonna go out later just so I could say I didn't get skunked, but. You got <laughs> So he finally beat me for the day and that's probably, that might be the biggest bass that we've got all, all year long. You know, I, we had the graph out this, this time. I marked the weed edge. I figured out where we were. I put him in the right spot and he did the hard work. You know, he cast it out and he got it, got it landed, fought it. It was a great, looked like a great fight. Hopefully it looks good on the camera. But yeah, good job, bud. Getting it.
Alright, don't forget guys, smash that like button, hit subscribe, hit the bell notification so you can see more donkeys coming soon, alright? Till next time, get out there and set that hook.